Well hello everybody, I'm your produce guy and today's produce tip we're going to talk about breaking down a fresh pineapple. Now pineapples are done very simply and easily but you can in the markets you can find some tools that will do a little more fancier job for you. Uh, sometimes they're called unitaskers because they can only do one job and so they clutter up your drawer and unless you're breaking down pineapples for some factory situation you, you probably don't need one it would be more of a novelty than anything I've seen one where you cut off the top of the pineapple and then like a corkscrew device you bring it down into the pineapple and it makes pineapple rings kind of an accordion effect it has they're all connected as it goes down through I've seen another one where you cut the pineapple in half and it has a couple of rings shapes kind of a U shape where you would scrape through the pineapple cutting off the uh, cutting off the fruit or the uh, skin of the fruit and then it has a secondary ring that cuts out the uh, core the tough core in the center either one of those seem like a lot more work than what we're going to do so let me have you come in close and we'll take a look all right we've got our ripe pineapple here and the first thing we do is we take that top and twist it off. There we go. All right, the next step, we're just going to cut this pineapple with a nice sharp knife right down the center. Right there. Now this would be the stage at which you would, if you had one of those uh, other products I was talking about with the rings, you'd probably take off the top and the bottom and run that thing through here, cutting off the skin there and then the cores right in here. But we're going to break these down just like we use uh, the mangoes. If you've seen our mango video, really simple. Just take that pineapple right there, that half, cut it into quarter, and then go one more time. Oh, it smells so good. Oh, Cut that into eighths right there. We might need to break that piece down. It's a little bit bigger there. But get these separated. And then very simply, we're just going to run our knife just above the skin. Bring that fruit out right there. There we are. You can see a little bit of skin there. Maybe trim that spot up right there. A little bit right there. Now, you've got the core that runs down here and that's easily identifiable. You can see the, the softer fruit right here. The tough core, it has a vertical um, grain, I guess we would call to that. So you just pull that out, that cross grain right there, and there you are, a wonderful, delicious piece of pineapple. Let me give you a close-up here so you can see the core right, uh, right through here is the core running, uh, running what would be up and down as the pineapple was this way. We've laid it down, and so you're going to want to cut just right along that area, get out the tough part. It still tastes good, it has good flavor, but it's it's chewy, so you don't want to use it on a fruit plate or in your uh, recipe that you're going to use it for. Well, there you see, very, very simple to break down that pineapple into the nice chunk sizes that you see in, your, uh, in the can that you'd buy at the store, except this is fresh. We know that fresh is best. I'm going to go ahead and finish breaking down this pineapple because I've got a great recipe that I'm going to use this fresh pineapple in. So be sure and watch for that video coming up. Thanks again for, to our subscribers, for those of us who are following us on Facebook, and our Twitter followers continue to grow. Thanks so much. Appreciate you watching. Remember, I am your produce guy, and fresh is best.